Well hey everyone, welcome back to the series Building a Strip Mall. As you see we have a Verizon store right here and that's what we'll be putting in here at this video. So I hope that you all enjoy this series so far. Now let's go ahead and get this started. Well, Alright, now something extremely, extremely important. This Verizon Wireless store right here is an old build. I went by an old video, an old tutorial that I've done a long time ago of this Verizon Wireless store. The original tutorial that I've done will be down below in the description. The only thing different is the original video was on a different map. I used the City Texture Pack. So, in this video I'll be showing you different blocks that you could switch up and the placement of this Verizon Wireless store. Now if you're following along with the series building the strip mall right here you need to pay attention and not just skip ahead because we have an alleyway here and we're going to be counting off that alleyway to be placing this Verizon Wireless store in this area. Again, that's only if you're following along with building this strip mall. If you're not following along and you just want a Verizon Wireless store, just go ahead and skip ahead and this tutorial will be down below. Well, Alright, now this is the original build. This is the city texture pack and this is what it looks like in this texture pack. Again, this video I'll show you different blocks that you guys can choose from. So again, this tutorial will be down below in the description. Also, I did a tour of the inside of this build the interior and that will be also down below in the description also something else I'll go ahead and put down there I did a tutorial long ago of how to make these phones on display so that's something else that you guys can go ahead and put in here so let's go ahead and get this started Welcome back to the series Building a Strip Mall. Now anybody new to the series, this GameStop right over here was the first build of the series. This Papa John's was the second. The Radio Shack was the third. This area here, the shipment area, dumpster pad area was the fourth. The Dollar General was the fifth. And now this here is going to be the sixth build of the series which is going to be a Verizon phone store right here. Now before actually starting that build we need to come right over here and get this area uh, all done that way you know the placement how far apart this store is from the back of this Dollar General. Alright so as you see I have the sidewalk here coming from Pop John's and GameStop three blocks wide and it will go all the way back behind this Dollar General three blocks wide here. As you see I have stone back here and the stone is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven blocks from the Verizon store here. And I also have the anisite in here for texture. Alright, now, right here I have eight blocks from here to here. And I have these walls coming up right here for a little walkway through here and then here for a uh, blocker there. Alright, right here we have the sidewalk coming up, which we'll get to that as we do the Verizon store. Back here we'll have a dumpster. Now all this back here I'll cover later on in the series. Because right now I really don't know what all is going to be right here. So we'll cover all that later on. This blue here will be a dumpster which is five blocks long and it will be three blocks wide. And we'll get back to that later on as well. Now right over here, again we'll get to this Verizon store in just a second. But right over here will be another entrance through here through the alleyway that way the dumpster truck and things can get through and it's going to be one two three four five six seven eight nine ten just for now again I'm not sure what I'm going to do right here yet alright now 
let's go ahead and look at the blocks of this Verizon store. Now, as you've seen, I built this Verizon store long ago and made a tutorial on it already. I also made a tour video, which I toured the inside of the video. Both of those videos, the tutorial and the tour video, will be down below in the description. So again, check that out. And the blocks that I'll be using on this build here is going to be a lot different from the blocks I used in the original tutorial because I'm in a different texture pack. As you see, the high definition texture pack is way different from the city texture pack. I'll be using the warp planks, the brown wool, the gray concrete, the acacia wood slab the acacia wood stairs, the red sandstone slab, the red concrete, and the red wool. I might use a few others later on, but that will be the main blocks. Alright, now, doing the tutorial on this Verizon store, what I'm going to do for you guys is just look down below in the description, and I'm going to put that tutorial down below again. You can follow that there because it would be kind of stupid for me to do another tutorial of the same exact store. So what I'm going to do guys is I'm just going to show you the placement of this and then later on you could do you could follow along with the tutorial down below. So now that we know the placement how far away from here and everything like that right here on the front of the build We'll have an entrance there, and then we'll have another entrance right over here. So what we're going to do is we're going to come to this corner right here, which I believe it was the in stone brick, the in stone block that I used here in the original video, and it's going to be three blocks this way and three blocks this way. This here was like a powder block in the original video. I'm going to use the brown wool. And I'm going to use the black concrete here. This here will be a window, three spaces in between, black concrete, three spaces in between, black concrete, three spaces in between, black concrete. This here will be an entrance, and it will be four blocks in between, black concrete, three blocks in between, black concrete, three blocks in between, black concrete, three blocks in between, and again, three, uh, black concrete. And this here will be the brown wool. And then pretty much do the same thing. So here is the three of those blocks. And then I'll wrap around three of those blocks. And it'll be the same thing as this side here. So again, you're going to follow along on the tutorial that I already done down below. Now the back of it here will be the brown wool going all the way to the back. And this will be the back corner. The only thing different I'm going to do on this is I'm going to put a double door here which will look at that later on in the video. So I have three blocks here from here and then two blocks for the double door. And then we have this brown wool going on this side connecting to this side which is the exact same as what we already went over. So again guys go ahead and look at the tutorial down below and go ahead and get this done and I'll be right back well, alright now this is what it should look like now I hope that the original tutorial went well for you guys that was an old tutorial long ago and I've come a long way since then so comment down below how did that go for you now again this is in the high definition texture pack and it looks a lot different on the textures but pretty much the same exact build so everything is the same exact pretty much so this is what it should look like I thank you guys all for watching and please let me know down below what you think of it so far of the series alright now right back here I have the dumpster and I went ahead and built it again it's a 3 by 5 and it's the same as what we been doing so up top it says trap doors you can use half slabs if you want and then fence gate like that right there so 
I hope that you all enjoyed this tutorial. And if you did, please hit that like down below. And let me know what you think of this series building a strip mall. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.